Hi, I'm Rachel Chamnus at SoundWavesHeal.com. Thank you so much for coming to my channel. I am a liquid Reiki sound healer, a spiritual teacher and counselor, and a channel medium. Today I want to talk about ascension and what it is. So, you've heard about ascension, you've heard about fifth dimension, or maybe you've not heard about it at all. And so I'm glad you're here. Let's talk about it. Earth is actually changing from its third dimensional reality into a fifth dimensional reality. So what that means is the earth itself is going to be changing into a different kind of space. Now when we talk about the third dimension and the fifth dimension, some people call it a third density or fifth density as well. So what's happening is that our selves, our human selves are also changing to a higher vibrational being. So we are now vibrating at a third dimensional reality density and we are going towards a fifth dimensional reality density. So we have the earth right now and I know that it feels like things are going really, really badly everywhere all over the earth. There are going to be a, there's going to be a reality shift where the third people who are not spiritual or ascended or, you know, people who um, aren't doing what they're supposed to be doing spiritually, helping other people, being good people, that sort of thing, are going to kind of look off into their own reality and sort of like a matrix-like reality. This, this is what um, spirit guides and angels and this is what they tell me. So this is how I have been told all this information. So they're going to kind of go off into this other reality. And when they do, it's just until, it's not a very good reality at all. You don't want to go there. But it's just kind of burn itself out because as people die, they're going to go back to where they came from, which is the one, the source, and then they'll look down, they'll say, oh, I kind of messed up, didn't I? But they'll be okay. But the ones of us who are ready to ascend, who work on ourselves, who are light workers, or who are on the light path, which is what I call the life's purpose of your life's purpose on this earth, if you're on your light path, meaning you're doing what you're supposed to do, or you're trying to be a good person, and you try to help people, all those sort of things, then you will be ascending to the fifth dimension. So the fifth dimension or fifth density is basically a higher vibrational space. And uh, we don't have all the details. Uh, everything I'm telling you is just what I have channeled and um, what I have uh, spoken with other mediums about and we, we agree on, or, you know, a lot of people have different ideas of what going fifth dimension is going to be. So it's not going to be a, uh, an immediate thing. Uh, there is supposed to be a big solar flare, and I do believe it will be this year in 2020. We'll see what happens. Um, that's what they tell me to speak sooner than you think. And in that solar flare, that is when the earth is going to change. And it's not something to be afraid of because we have a lot of galactical beings right outside our planet who are just ready to help us so they're not all bad don't listen to the media there aren't they aren't all great either most of them are really good uh, some of them are really not and the ones that are the worst actually are already on this planet so um, we will be escaping them because they cannot go to the fifth dimension because they are not on a positive light path <laughs> sorry there's wind in here okay so that's what we're going to be going to. So that's what ascension is. We are going to be vibrating higher. Do you know what vibrates higher? There's lots of densities. Angels vibrate very high. We have gods and goddesses. Um, that's how we know them, like Greek goddesses or Celtic goddesses or things like that. Um, they kind of, they're around the 10th dimension or density, they tell me. Angels are, can be really high, up to 13th there are dragons, there are all kinds of elementals, fairies, elves, they all, they all are at a higher dimension or density. So these are beings that can talk to mediums, but and we can kind of see them, but they're not physically here. I can't touch them, they aren't 3D. Do you see what I mean? They're 5D or higher. And so that's why you need mediums to channel their message. Or you can become a medium. I also teach that and I help people with their clairs and meeting lots of these high vibrational vibes. That's in fact what my tag VIP group is all about, my monthly group. But anyway, we have these different beings that vibrate at different densities and also ascended masters are also there too. So we are just still in this third dimensional space and it's a pretty low space. 
But when we ascend to the fifth dimension, then things will be much better. Now, there will be a, a great period of time where things have to um, acclimate. You know, it's not going to be like, bam, solar flare, everything's awesome and great. It's like, we're still going to have bodies, I believe. That's what they tell me. We're still going to have these bodies. We're still going to be doing things, but things will be much better because everyone will be on the path of let's help each other and be a good person. Do you see what I mean? Let's, let's um, work on the spiritual path together. It's going to be more of a community. And as the earth rebuilds, we'll have the help of these extraterrestrials who want to help us while the earth is rebuilding. And then we will have another great golden age period. So a golden age is what's coming. And this is, this is going to be a long-term sort of thing of ascension because there's higher than the fifth dimension too, which we will eventually be going higher than the fifth dimension. So it's, it's a transitional period. But we have help of high dimensional beings such as um, extraterrestrials, ascended masters, angels, all our spirit guides, dragons, elementals, etc. All those that I was talking about and more gods and goddesses. And they will all help us. Uh, and in the golden age, which you have heard of Atlantis or Lemuria, these are golden ages that we had before. This is going to be a beautiful time. It's going to last a very long time, and it's going to be really beautiful. So this is what we're headed towards. That is what ascension means, and that's what we mean by the fifth dimension. So in this third dimensional reality, we have a hard time uh, really understanding knowledge and truths. So our full soul, our higher self, sits in our soul star, soul star chakra, which is above the head, about 12 inches. And that's where it sits. And so not all of it can fit into this body. And so this body doesn't have all the information the higher self has, and neither does yours. And so once we get to the golden age, you will have all that knowledge, all that spiritual knowledge, all the knowledge that you had before this life about past lives, about the world, about love, about relationships, about everything that you don't have here. See, when we came into this world, we took the veil of amnesia, which means that as earthlings, we don't have any proof of spiritual help, of higher help, of source, God, however you want to call it. We don't, we don't have any of that. We just have to go on faith. But when we get to the fifth dimension, it will be plain. And we won't have that wondering, am I all alone feeling, which we're actually not all alone. We have spirit guides and we have helpers every minute. But... It's easy to feel that way, and that's what makes it hard. This is like a great big experiment where we said, oh, I want to come into this body and be on Earth and worry about totally mundane things and not even know, not even know that I have so much love, so much help all around me all the time, and I'll think I'm all alone, and I'll have to find love in a hard world when really love is always there and is always around me, and I have so much help, but I won't know it. And what will happen? What will I do? And that's the great experiment of this life. So I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you subscribe. Check me out at soundwavesheal.com. If you'd like to learn more, maybe you'd like to check out my tag VIP group. It's soundwavesheal.com forward slash T-A-G tag. Stands for Transformation and Ascension Group with Rachel Shamus. So that's me. Thank you so much. And I'll see you soon. I hope.